Hello, this is David and I'm from Excel Consulting. In this video, I'm going to show you one of my coolest favorite tricks in the new PowerPoint, how to convert from text to icons using AI's tool called Designer. So let's go into this slide. I'm actually going to do a series of videos using PowerPoint's awesome Design Ideas tab um, as of October 2019. And we're going to cover images, charts, lists, in this time, we're covering lists, then branded slides, and then entire theme. And let's show you exactly what I mean. I can just click on this slide, go to the Design tab. On the right, I have Design Ideas. What does that do? Look at that. So it's actually picked a relevant icon for each of these. Um, these icons are very special. Um, PowerPoint calls them icons, in fact. They're not images, which is why it can choose different colors based on what's in them. And if you don't like what it's given you, you can click on it, click on this lightning one and replace your icon with something else. I don't like any of those, so I can do see all icons. And I can look for maybe an artist's palette for branding like that, click insert. And it does it super fast. It actually uses AI to even generate these similar ones. So these are all things to do with lists, which isn't bad as well. Um, so again, click on the design tab or sometimes in the home tab, you have design ideas as well. In the newer version, they've just put it in there. So you have different layouts for how you want them to be. Some of these designs um, are completely different, maybe don't have icons. Uh, Microsoft use this feature a ton and they recommend it a ton as well. If you don't like the color scheme, you can either select the three shapes and change the color to something standard. Or this is an item called Smart Art. So, well, you can even change it back if you want, but this item called Smart Art has two tabs here, design and format, and you can change the icons and the way it looks there. Now, sometimes it does give you this kind of outline there um, and you need to manually take that out. But uh, I'm assuming that will change soon and you won't need to do that when you change it. So interestingly, <laughs> if you have animations like here, it doesn't seem to give you these same things. So design ideas now will not give me these standard set of icons. But the moment I remove animations from all of them and then go back to design ideas, look at that, it pops back with the icons. Who knew? <laughs> um, if you have something that's already a smart art, it can also give you these icons like this one. How about now apparently is a duck. Um, it doesn't always get it that right, but that's okay. Great. All right. So that's the end of what I wanted to show you. As I said, we're going to look at PowerPoint AI designer um, ideas, and we're going to look at using it with images, charts, and future videos, using it with branded slides, and it can even generate an entire theme. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe and keep an eye out for some new videos like it. Thanks for watching.